up guys and welcome to the review of a Windows Phone 8 themed ROM for the X8 but before we start the review let's talk about the ROM itself it's based on Android 2.3.7 gingerbread so you can expect it to run smoothly on the X8 which has a low powered CPU most of the apps are specially designed to match the Windows Phone apps and the launcher is identical to that on the Microsoft powered phones to begin with let's start with the lock screen the lock screen itself is been built into the launcher so together they make up a unique looking application you swipe from the bottom towards the upper space of your screen to unlock and if you have a password you enter it first and then proceed to the next test So unlocking the screen you are presented with a launcher. You have no widgets or shortcuts, but live tiles. The phone live tile presents you with a number of missed calls, if there are any, and the same goes with the messaging app too. In the gallery tile you can set up your own set of pictures that you want to be previewed by simply pressing it and then hitting the edit button you tap live picture live gallery picture and then you set your own pictures your other options are either to erase it or resize any other tile jumping to the app drawer which you do by swiping to the left you can see that your apps are listed in a horizontal column with the letters between them and when you tap on a letter an alphabet is presented in a grid and when you tap to a central letter you are transferred to the apps that begin with this letter you can go to your launcher settings by anywhere in it by pressing the main the menu button and selecting the themes option here you can change your start screen options your lock screen options and app list customizing the way you are pleased also Another beautiful application is the contacts application. Sorry, not the phone, the contacts application. It has nice transitions and effects from the Windows Phone app. And is very fast and fluid. The same goes for the music app. It presents your songs, albums, tracks, genres, genres or playlists in the list mode. And the album art of a song is very well presented. So you can see it has a background picture too for each song and the buttons or play, preview or next are well spaced too. Now let's talk about battery life. If you're a normal average user, your phone will easily last through the whole day without any problems. But for those power users like me who overclock at 700 plus megahertz and have Wi-Fi and data always on with full brightness, you'll get about roughly seven to eight hours of usage in conclusion I can definitely say that the this is indeed 
a interesting ROM and is definitely worth checking out. If you want to give it a try, the links will be down in the description. For more videos and reviews like this, feel free to check my channel and subscribe and also like the video if you liked what you saw. Till the next time, bye!